Going fast in games is pretty fun, so I added that. After adding the build mode, I felt like something was missing. It couldn't just be, you know, just building like trust parts from, you know, the first version. So I thought of adding like something like a trampoline or in this case, it's a booster. And the first iteration of it, well, it, it worked out pretty well, but you could basically place multiple of them. But this had a few problems. If you could place multiple of them, you could quite literally just make a catapult and I think it was too much. It was fun for sure, but again, I, it was it didn't feel right for it to be like that easy to get like a thousand speed just within like one second. I feel like you should, you know, work more harder for it, but what do you guys think? Do you guys want to be able to, you know, place maybe five of them or just have it you know you can only place one and you need a group of people to work together to place multiple of them and these boosters are pretty overpowered as well because you can go back to them just you know using redirect and you just gain way more speed i also added a third build mode which is called a trap this allows the player to basically build traps around the map so you can like block some areas out and whoever touches those traps, they get stunned for one second. I can change that later on. And it's supposed to also be so that, like, you won't get stunned by it if you're the one placing it. But just for showcasing it, because I'm playing by myself, uh, if you touch it, you get stunned. And I think it's pretty cool. As well as it's also pretty cool to use for building because it's only the thing. It's like one of the things that, like, it's like a wall. I feel like having a model for it would be better, but... Let me know what you guys think of it. Should I add like a texture to it or like to just keep it the way it is? And by the way, it's one, two, and three to change between build modes. To recap, we have, you know, the normal trust part that was like, kind of like a web. We have the booster, which, you know, if you touch it, you just go pretty fast and you can only place one right now. So that's just to balance it out. And then we have the trap. So like you can use it to literally just block out areas and I made sure to make it so it's it the size of it depends on the distance that you're trapping so the bigger the distance the larger it will be and this allows for you to just you know catch people who are stuck in them so let's say if it was what I have planned is to add like a crown game mode so if you want to catch the crown player you trap them in your web and then you go and grab the crown and then you can get away I think that will be really fun and it's a pretty unique gameplay mechanic for it. And for the booster, even with one booster, you're actually able to, you know, get an insane amount of speed. And I think this is fair because you have to really build like an actual particle accelerator to get enough speed to fling yourself in any direction you would want to go to. So it's more balanced like this, having the player only place one booster and they use you know their webs and their swinging to then get enough momentum to just launch themselves and if you have more players you can build a larger one a faster one or if you want to go faster you just build a way large catapult because it actually has its own speed limit so if you make a small one you don't really have that large of a like that large of velocity when you're spinning around in it but if you have a pretty big one you get way more speed and if you all notice something different, you can see that I've added two new maps to the game. Epilepsy warning. We obviously have the first map, which is this map. And to be honest with you, I don't know why, but this is the most fun map out of all the three. I don't know why. It could be because of the fact that, like, you can grapple in any direction and that you have something to grapple onto in any direction possibly because of that i'm not entirely sure but it's just a really fun map to play on the next map or the second map that i made is called the city map and in this one i really tried to go for that spider-man world ish 
like gameplay so you would swing from you know building to building and weirdly enough this was the least fun map it's probably because of the fact that it's really simple like you just go up and sideways and that's it like it's there's a lot of room for like you know flying basically and i think the way this map can be used is when you know we have a lot of players building stuff i think building will really add a lot more value to this map because it's basically just a sandbox so that you can build your webs you can build boosters and just fly around the map and i have this set up so like some places you have really tall buildings and some places you have really short buildings so going up and trying to go up the tall buildings is going to be pretty fun as well but it's 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 a second map basically and i totally didn't get distracted the third map i had added was quite literally based off of the testing i did to get the city map and i wanted to make it more fun so i went more closer to the first map in terms of randomness but also more towards the second map in terms of like terrain generation and i got this mess and this one is actually pretty fun it's a mix of both so it's very open fairly open but it's also like you know it has room so that you can you know swing yourself around parts and also it's the gaps are large enough but also small enough so that you can build in them and i think that would be really fun so you can build webs traps whatever you want to in those little like holes basically kind of like cheese and this map turned out to be pretty unique, in my opinion. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this devlog number two. The progress on this game is fairly slow, but I'm taking it slow so that I can really take my time on testing as well as like just getting it right because again, I'm making this so that it's fun. Like I want to make sure that it's a fun game and not just, you know, just another like cash grab game or something like that i don't want to do that i want to make it a pretty fun game and i want to make it based on other games which are also fun that i played before so yeah and i think the building mechanic is pretty unique like like, like building while you're moving like that is kind of unheard of like like this and yeah i can't wait to see what you guys think of it can't wait to, i can't wait for you guys to play around with the boosters and just you know play the game it's all in the description and for my next devlog i will have the round system hopefully i also have another plan to make a score system so we can do like stunts but that means i have to then work on animating so stick around for that well i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys want to see more make sure to subscribe and i'll see you guys on the next one bye